It has returned, this image shows Mercury's sodium ion tail, which is about 1 degree long and should become more noticeable over the course of the next few days. As Mercury circles the Sun, its tail gets brighter and dimmer. This film from NASA's Messenger spacecraft, which spent years closely observing Mercury's tail, displays the predictable pattern. Mercury's tail is brightest when the planet is plus or minus 16 days from perihelion, or closest approach to the Sun. For reasons related to the Doppler shift of sodium absorption lines in the solar spectrum, December 7th was the most recent perihelion. This indicates that on December 23rd, the tail will be at its brightest. The smallest planet in the solar system, Mercury, has a comet-like tail composed primarily of sodium ions that are dispersed from the planet's surface by impacts from micrometeors and the solar wind, since 2001. Scientists have been aware of Mercury's tail and have found that its size varies according to the planet's distance from the Sun. Around 60 to times longer than the distance between Earth and the Moon, the tail reaches a maximum length of 14.9 million miles. Mercury's weak atmosphere and proximity to the Sun allow the solar wind to easily tear up the planet's surface, which is why the tail extends such a great distance. Sodium glows bright orange from scattered sunlight. Additionally, this scattering process pushes sodium atoms. During some parts of Mercury's year, this radiation pressure is strong enough to strip the atmosphere and give Mercury a long, glowing tail. At the right time of year, a person standing on Mercury's night side would notice a faint orange that resembles the sky of a city lit by sodium lamps.